Welcome to Immigration Visa News. Biden administration accelerating the EAD document, employment authorized document for immigrants, especially asylum seekers. It's really breaking news because Biden is trying to reform the immigration right from the first day he was in office. USCIS will accelerate the processing of EAD due to this law which is in Congress. Normal timing of EAD is six months and it will be processed sooner than six months and might be in 30 days for the different countries. These facilities are being given to Asia, Cuba, Venezuela and some other countries. These humane policies of immigration really giving opportunity for United States, those people who want to work by legal way according to this law, if anybody is eligible to work, mean that he will get a job in any company and he's an asylum seeker, he will be able to get the EAD sooner than six months and USCIS will process his application by speedy way. These reforms is really a wave of happiness for those individuals who want to work legally in the United States and they are on asylum. There are many steps Biden administration is taking like border security. There are two main objectives of these immigration reforms of the Biden administration to give full opportunity to the workers and the people who are in the United States. If they are eligible to work, if they have some skills, if they get job in companies, they must be given permission to work by legal way. Second one, to protect the security so that foreign people without law, when they will come, they will be handled properly. So these two these two type of objectives are very good on one side these are humane in the nature because if you will follow the law if you want to work in legal way you will get your EAD card you will get your green card if you will not follow the law by border security though definitely the security departments are being strengthened by giving a lot of money to stop the anti-law actions thank you very much subscribe my channel and like my channel and be updated for the latest immigration and visa news thank you very much